Okay, so apparently I'm checking like the best of the best of the gacha channels. And apparently, this is what people claim is the best. So I'm still ranting about it because clearly gacha is the enemy of the people, without a doubt. So I'm gonna rant about this video because it is original from what they claim. And it's a trash pop song. Why the hell am I ranting on an animator that's wasting her talent? Well, because it will aggravate tons of people from what someone claims. So yeah, sure. It's already a horrible start when the title is like a light blue background, like too lazy to make a background, just pretty much add the color in and add the title saying, loved with your loved. What the hell does that even mean? That you're pretty much wanting to ruin your entire life? Here's what happens when you get a girlfriend, like almost certainly, but there is a small chance that you might get lucky. If you decide to randomly like someone for no goddamn reason whatsoever, the relationship ended immediately. Like, literally, you're not gonna get kids by liking someone for no reason. That's classified as stalkers or pedophiles. Look at Mini Lad. You are, I'm just nitpicking. You could literally do the exact same as I'm doing later on because I'm gonna be ranting about the entire thing. Oh, love's a crazy game. That's the reasons why I despise pop songs. Love is nothing about crazy. Hell, love is pretty much an excuse just to keep a relationship or probably keeping the kid in a house or something. There's no such thing as, well, L-O-V-E. You know what? I'm just gonna get some wise words from Toby Fox. From what Toby Fox claims his own body video game he made that is a massive spoiler, it says, L-O-V-E is level of violence. Where's the E? No clue. It is the most mysterious thing by far and people theorize that for years. You know what is a crazy game back in centuries ago? Well, that's the whole point. War existed. Yeah, more reasons why I hate pop songs. That is flat auto-tuned. It doesn't even sound like singing. <laughs> That's what he sounds like if you remove the auto-tune. Also, this is tons of shortcuts I'm seeing here. Like the person barely moving, very slow as possible, no change of background whatsoever. Oh my god. And they even change with the birds, they just fade out. It's an effect, not animation. And before I hear, well, this is all the words excuse. Oh my god. Well, that's why animation takes months and years to make. Nonsense logic part one. There's a gate, and now you remove a gate for no reason. Like, he holds the gate, there was logic with it. You don't just remove things that have no logic whatsoever. So this is part of a lucid dream, which means nothing realistically happens and no logic exists as an excuse where the creator can do what the hell they want and what the anime can do what the hell they want. Which means, do stupid stuff like this. Did the anime just stop bothering with the lip syncing? They can't use love in an excuse there. He was too busy singing and now they're like, you don't want it, screw it. Lip syncing, too difficult. I don't want to animate or work that much since I'm making them in less than a month or probably a few days at best just to show off how hard I'm working. I'm spending hundreds of hours of no life hours of literally garbage. Lazy transition, light trader, what the hell is that garbage? First off, this music it has no such thing as a guitar whatsoever. So there was no point adding that instrument whatsoever. Ever. Secondly, what's the point of having a keyboard when you can literally make music on your laptop? I'm not joking, you could just press stuff like this and you just made music on Logic Pro X. Let me get the image right here, here's the image. First off, this is the worst guitar player I've ever seen in my entire life. She's only playing one note, or one chord. Like this is what it sounds like. Yeah, that actually sounds pretty damn accurate. And before you say, Oh, it's discorded! Well, the acoustic guitar will sound the exact same. One chord, one note, sounds terrible. Since gotcha characters are like deformities or birth defects, they pretty much don't have fingers. So what they should have done is this. Drop D tuning, playable for all deformed birth defect gotcha characters. If you think this sounds terrible, well that's because they aren't following the pop song because the pop song has no guitar whatsoever. What is- Oh yeah, the bloody keyboard! Gotcha characters cannot play a piano. I mean, they don't have fingers. That is required to play this instrument. If you don't have fingers, that means it'll sound like, you know, god-awful notes. Like, I'm not expecting Pixar Soul quality of perfection, because that is near impossible for, like, this type of nonsense. I'm asking for adding instruments that makes sense in the gotcha world, because that's what you're world building and what you're animating on. And the laptop, dear god, I'm almost certain that they're gonna fail an English essay because of typing like this. 
Wow, it actually is pretty damn accurate how Billy Irish and Justin Bieber makes god awful music. Why am I going on about instruments? Because the official video is constantly showing instruments. I expect them to get it right if you're gonna include any of this stuff. If it's too complicated for you, don't bother with it. But before I hear the excuse saying, oh, stop taking it so seriously, it's just an art style. Okay, if I, it's not supposed to be taken seriously, why ain't I smiling? Why ain't I laughing? It's called the official music video. Video is attempting to be serious. Congratulations, if you touch someone for no reason and you just immediately love them by staring at them, you are arrested or killed by Romeo and Juliet, by Shakespeare, why you should not have relationships. After him repeating love over and over again like every other pop song with Justin Bieber yummy, we start to see random references from video games. I'm not sure if the anime are mentored or not, but yeah, they do look like it to me. We have Dance Dance Revolution, Frisk Undertale reference, Guitar Hero reference, Doki Doki Literal Cop reference. Yeah, you get the point with this lazy transition where they light up the screen as quick as possible. You forget faded and black, we need white, we need to make the people blind and hurt their eyes more. And they're still repeating that trash melody that rips off the vocals. Okay, the whole point of melody is that it's used for one specific part and then they change the other melody for the other emotional part. They're not used to reuse constantly. Well, unless you're in a metal song, but if you're gonna keep reusing them for the entire thing, then what's the point of having a melody? It just makes it boring. She already does know and she's trying to get away from you because you're stalking her for no goddamn reason. I mean, this official music video is only three minutes and she's supposed to like you in three minutes? That is legit stalking and Peter failure there. Okay, that's every animation and lyrics we talk about. Animation, the rest of it's just reusing any assets as possible, like the one furling in the background randomly. It's just nonsense there. It was added in because there was a lyric called Fallen. And then the, the lyrics, well, it makes the person singing it sounds like a stalker. If any lady heard that, they would have walked away immediately and said, That guy's a creep. We need to call 911 or 000 immediately. I think it's a good time for an outro because I am preparing for a part 2 if any of her fan base rants on me and just complain, OMG, you advertise dislike because I don't give videos a chance? And I'm gonna be like, well too bad, I made a rant video for a fan, that means I got $50 for a reward. A-U-T-R-O, outro. Uh, in addition to that, we have to uh, make sure that we, uh, we are in a position that we are... Well, let me, let me go to the second thing. Unlike the African-American community, with notable exceptions, the Latino community is an incredibly diverse community.